Hey, hey everyone, everyone. Welcome, welcome back, back to, to Five Minute Eats. All right guys, today we got a little plant-based meat item for you. And this one is funky. Yes, it is. Hopefully it doesn't taste too funky though. This is the Good Catch plant-made chef mastered fish free tuna naked in the water real seafood taste chunk albacore texture contains 350 milligrams of dha high in protein and it has 14 grams of a protein six plant blend gluten-free vegan and non-gmo this was around three dollars and fifty cents for this package and it has 3.3 ounces we got it at target now plant-based meat is like the rage nowadays right or they're trying to shove it down our throats try to get us to embrace it mm -hmm. some of them are good now here's the thing man fish that's funky. I guess it's just a matter of time till we eat only plant-based meat, right? Uh, it not seems me. like not well, me. <laughs> <laughs> you may not have a choice. So you gotta <laughs> embrace your destiny. And this is what we're doing here, man. Now visually, it looks It looks like tuna. It looks like tuna. It doesn't smell like tuna. No, it smells because if you guys don't know, we love tuna, and so I love the, the lemon pepper one, mm -hmm. the packet that is. So I was excited when I saw this, but the smell, it's not that great. And if you guys are new to our channel, basically we review everyday grocery items. So before you spend your hard earned money, let us tell you if it's worth it. Now this says in water, but it's kind of in a gelatinous, um, substance. If you'd like to support this channel, the easiest way to do that is using our Amazon links the next time you shop there. All right, guys, I'm ready. I'm ready. So our rating system, thumbs up, we would buy this again, thumbs down, we would not. So for me, guys, this is a big thumbs down. And the reason is, this is pretty much a combination of different beans to shape and look like tuna. You can really taste the bean in this. It's just funky, it doesn't work. Um, I think it needed like some sort of like a lemon or something like that, you know, like lemon mm -hmm. pepper, like the other tuna packets, or it needs to be drenched in olive oil or something. <laughs> this has no personality other than just beans. Mm -hmm. And so for that reason, it doesn't work. Okay, so for me, this is gonna be a big thumbs down. It is quite honestly very disgusting and I like beans, but this is, it, it's, it tastes nothing like tuna at all whatsoever. At least some of the other plant-based meats do kind of taste like that meat. This is a complete miss on that. Also, the texture is not really like tuna, even though it somewhat resembles tuna. It is quite gross. And we smelled like a smell whenever we opened it up and it tastes exactly like the smell of it and the smell of it is not good at all. You think it's probably the chickpea. Um, it's just, it really does not work. And I feel like there are some things that just don't need to be made into a fake meat. Like if you're vegan, I don't feel like you really need like a fake meat for every real meat that is out there. So maybe just pass on the fake tuna because this is quite terrible. And I feel like if you are someone that used to eat meat and you've had real tuna, you would be appalled at the taste of this. So here's what this thing has, just a few of the ingredients. Chickpea flour, lentil protein, fava protein, navy bean flour, uh, sea salt, sunflower oil, seaweed powder, et cetera, et cetera. And pretty much guys, you get the hint. So guys, to sum it up, thumbs down, thumbs down. And if you buy from Amazon, use our Amazon link. The reason is when you do that, we get 10 cents, 50 cents, possibly even a dollar, which means we get to continue to review things. All right, guys, that's the video. If you like what we're doing here, definitely check out our other channel, Food Prep Inc. And don't forget to give us a like and subscribe.